Hello and welcome to the WordPress Covert Links plugin overview. I'll go ahead and show you how to install and set up and use. It'll take just a few minutes to watch this and let's go ahead and get started right on it. First thing of course is you want to go into your dashboard of your WordPress install. Something I'd like to cover real quickly here is permalinks. I hope that you're using permalinks. If you're not, you're missing out on some uh, better search engine ranking for sure and it makes it uh, easier for people to find stuff on your blog. There are no question marks and numbers and such as. You can go through here and choose any of these that you like. Okay. It doesn't matter. You can do the month and the name, day and name, whatever you would like. I use the custom structure, and that is basically just a post name. Okay, what that means is, is if I do a post or a page or whatever, and I call it uh, Google, it's just going to be my domain name uh, .com or whatever it is, slash Google. Uh, again, there's no numbers and not a lot of long URLs. It helps a lot. So I highly suggest that you go ahead and activate permalinks if you have not it uh, works out better for you okay let's go ahead and install the plugin now we want to go over here and add new and we want to upload and we'll browse to it okay and you should have your folder here let's get that down so you can see click it install now activate it And now you should have over here under your settings tab. If it's not expanded, go ahead and expand it. Click on covert links. Okay, and there we go. Okay, I've already got one set up here. And I want you to notice this is because I am using a uh, machine on a local server in the office here. Uh, it's actually not on a domain out on the internet, but it's still going to work. This is our uh, test machine. So actually, yours will be yourdomain.com or subdomain, however you've got your WordPress install. So don't pay much attention to this in the video, but what you you will see on yours, whatever your domain name is here is where it will appear. Okay, so all I've done here is, of course, is I've gotten Google. That one's set up, and I can do I can do any of them. You know, what you're doing here is whatever you want to call it. you got an affiliate program or something that you like, you type it in. I'm just going to do a simple one here and show you. Okay, and you save the links, and it's done, okay? And it'll add one blank spot after each one that you add. Now, to use this, of course, you would use whatever your domain name is. If you've got it installed in the root directory of uh, yourdomain.com, then you would use yourdomain.com slash yahoo, okay? Or if you've got it in a directory, whatever the case may be. So all we do now is is enter in enter in our domain name. Of course, I'm going to go to our in-house server here, and I'm going to type in the our domain name slash Yahoo, and you'll see. Wham! There we go. And that's all there is to actually installing, setting up, and using the WordPress Covert Links plugin. Thanks for watching and have a great day.